Welcome, today I'll explain blending modes, overlays and demonstrate a few examples, so let's get started. Stage 1. What are blending modes and overlays? A blending mode is a feature that allows multiple clips, images, text and other assets to mix or blend together. An overlay is the asset itself that we want to apply. Take this raw clip for example and let's say I want to apply this burn overlay onto it. Overlays always stay on top of a clip no matter which layer, so in my case clip 1 is on layer 1 and the overlay is on layer 2. I will apply the light and blending mode which will remove all the dark pixels on the overlay and retain the brighter part which is the burn on the left side. As a result I have achieved a burning effect although this works better as a transition if placed between two clips like so. Stage 2 Blending modes explained. You'll find settings for various blending modes in the effects tab underneath opacity. The modes have been split into four sections, starting at the top from darken to darker color which remove white pixels, however the term I'm going to be using is transparent like a PNG, so this section makes white pixels transparent. The second section from lighten to lighter color makes black pixels transparent which is the opposite. The next makes grey pixels transparent, so if you wanted to apply a grain overlay you'd use this mode. And finally, the last section creates a difference between the two clips. Think of it as an invert effect. Stage 3 Examples For my first clip, I want to apply this 8mm overlay which has a bit of grain and I want to make the white parts transparent to reveal the clip inside the frame so I'll apply the darken blending mode. Looks pretty good, however if I select another mode from the same section, the results will differ. So if I pick multiply instead of darken, the overlay keeps a lot more colour and detail such as grain. I'm flicking back and forth between the two so that you can see the difference. Let's move on to clip 2. Here I want the dark parts transparent so these scratches are the only thing visible so I'll pick lighten. The result looks great but what about screen? Still looks great but slightly different to lighten. Which one should you pick? This is always a matter of preference. Your clips and overlays are different to mine so you need to judge which setting looks best. In my case I prefer lighten as it isn't as striking as screen. Same section, different results. For clip 3 I have this grain overlay with a grey background. These kinds of overlays work best with hard light. I don't really see it visible when using overlay and other settings so I'll stick with this one. So if it doesn't look good, try another setting. And finally, the last clip with some basic white text on top. If I apply different, it inverts the text, allowing it to stand out. I'd say these are highly experimental and quite complex, so it's difficult explaining these settings. The same applies to the last section, which I purposely avoided, like hue and luminosity, if I said that correctly. But if it looks good, use it. Peace.